Working the night shift always sucked. I work in an office building and would constantly do the night shift since it was the only time it would work out for me. I was just about always the only person on the floor I worked on, possibly in the whole building. There would always be a kind of eerie feeling to being in such a big building with most of the lights out and absolutely no one around. But on the upside, it was peaceful and less stressful and I was able to get a lot of work done. There was this one night though, it was a Friday night around 2 in the morning. I was typing away on my keyboard when I heard a noise from outside my cubicle. It sounded like just a random crack from the walls or something. It's unusual in this building, but I didn't get too concerned about it. I resumed typing away and was once again interrupted by a sound. This time, the sound of a computer starting up. It caught me off guard. I, I was sure nobody else was working the night shift. I stood up on my chair to get a view over the cubicle walls. The glare of a computer screen in the dark was visible in a cubicle on the opposite side of the room. Then I did something stupid, something I regret. I asked if there was anybody there in a yell, hoping to get an answer from a fellow employee. But instead, I saw the glaring light of the computer monitor across the room turn off, and there was once again nothing but darkness on that side of the room. I started getting nervous. I turned off the lamp and computer screen so that I wouldn't give away my position to whoever that was. I crouched down and tiptoed out across to a nearby cubicle. There was just utter silence. I sat waiting for something to happen for god knows how long, but I eventually decided the coast was clear. I tiptoed down past all the cubicles until I reached the opening near the exit door to the stairs and elevators, and that's when I realized that my fearful suspicion was true. There was a man crouched down behind a plant in the corner of the room dressed in all black. I felt my heart sink as I noticed him, but it didn't seem like he knew that I noticed him. I turned back to the stairway door. There was no way I was going to wait for the elevator and take a chance. I casually opened the door and closed it behind me, proceeding to walk down the stairs. After making it down about two flights of stairs, I heard the door above me push open aggressively, followed by manic echoing footsteps coming fast down the stairs. I raced down the stairs, running as fast as I could, all while the footsteps above me were getting louder. I finally made it to the first floor, raced through the lobby, and out the front door. Whoever was in there didn't follow me. I immediately called the cops, along with one of my bosses. My boss said no one was scheduled to work except for me. The cops scanned the place from top to bottom. There was no one in there. I couldn't help them out with any description other than he was wearing all black. I did continue to do the night shift for about a week after that, with my boss allowing me to lock all possible entrances to the floor, including the elevators. But I still wasn't comfortable with it, so ever since, I've been doing the day shifts.